Yo, it's your boy Wavy Fredo, man. We is back here with another one as always. Today we got some new. We have officially, officially, as we already knew, we already knew what this Call of Duty would be called. We already knew that we was getting a new Black Ops, but it's always good to have things confirmed. So today we will be talking about that, that it is indeed Black Ops 6, the 6 of Black Ops. We have a whole lot of things to talk about we got a, 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 a plethora of hidden info we have an official teaser which we're going to get into right now and after that we will be talking about the hidden info so without further ado we're going to get right into that i will not hold you guys any longer let's look at this teaser i should wake him up Now, this is an interesting teaser because it's like slowly, like, like kind of all over the place. Um, it's a, it's a lot we don't understand. It's a lot we don't know. We see people hiking in the dark or whatever the hell that they're doing. We see it's a lot going on. And then towards the end, we see an officer and we see the uh, Mount Rushmore, you know, customized to how they would like the truth lies. So there's a whole lot going on and in 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 later days we will obviously get more information which is when i will be able to give more information to you guys but as of now this is all we got but there is a whole lot of um hidden info in these trailers or just a whole lot of different things that we could be talking about which we will talk about right now so let's get into that now to begin with the hidden info we will start with this uh this newspaper article now some may say what does newspaper have to do with anything um there has obviously been rumors going around that black ops 6 will be basically centered around the gulf war which happened in 1990s and in the 1990s majority of people got their news through what hmm newspaper which is what you're looking at so i think again just like i say with everything else appearances everything like i actually think that is dope that they made this a newspaper article to actually kind of in a way advertising market black ops 6 to make it like this is really the gulf war this is what's going on um the game is on newspaper because that is what people went to to go get their news they didn't have internet and all these phones and motherfuckers didn't like if you wanted to watch you didn't watch the news and all that you go get the newspaper you, you got the the newspaper board throwing that shit on your porch every morning woo -woo, or you go down the street to the quarters to the store when you put your quarter in and you get all that anyway like I said, people got uh, their news from newspapers prime, uh, primarily, which is why we have this on newspaper. Moving on. Now, directly after the announcement of the reveal day, which is June 9th, Raven went to X, a.k.a. Twitter, to announce that they are very excited to be um, partnering with Treyarch. We know that they're both confirmed to be in the game, but to uh, be that they are excited to be partnering with Treyarch on this new Call of Duty chapter. Now, there has been a leak, of course not confirmed yet, that Raven is behind the scenes working on the campaign. That is very interesting because that's not normal exactly. But we know that they are both working together on this new Call of Duty and that uh, a leak says, which is probably true, that Raven is working on the campaign. Now, also, Treyarch went on to Twitter aka x twitter whichever you may to go to update their banner which is b06 the logo and if you look to the close uh, to the top right you'll see that it says gulf gulf war hint uh going back to what we talked about in the beginning with this game taking place in the early 90s which is the gulf war remember newspaper all of that um moving on we've also seen this black ops 6 logo with a soldier to the right and uh it is unaware who this is we do not know who this is it hasn't been confirmed who this is but there are plenty of theories i don't won't bother to go through with them um obviously if you know you know if you don't hey whatever 
Now, if you go to the Call of Duty uh, dot com slash Black Ops Six website, you will be welcome to this, which shows the uh, Xbox showcase and the Black Ops reveal will be June 9th, which is what we said before. Now, the interesting part is if you look to the right right here where it says this profile it has a small passage, which we cannot see because it's blocked off for whatever reasons. But you can see that it says R U right here, which has basically confirmed that russell adler will be in the game if you know you know if you don't whatever but i will not go through this and read it i will place this up in the description so you can read it yourself because obviously it's a lot of things that we will miss half of this is gone but if you care to read it and you care to look at it if you haven't already read it right here then i will place it up in the description for you now uh like i said the important parts of this is this passage eventually we probably will know what this passage means hopefully we do if we do i will let you guys know but the important information is russell adler will be inside of the game also if you look to the left over here you will see the word golf going back to the beginning where we said that this game will be surrounded about around the gulf war which happened in the early 90s bingo now back to the truth lies if you go to the truth lies.com website you will be welcomed by this right here i think this is very dope because like i said again appearance is everything and if you notice like come on man a fucking tv this is dope and the great thing is i don't want to get a uh, copyright blocked but you can do things with this like you can turn the tv up you can turn the tv down if you press record you will download the uh the actual trailer well the teaser that we watched earlier and if you flip through the channels which we will do in a minute obviously that and if you pause you pause and it'll play this little scary ass music and if you turn it off you turn the tv off but turn the tv back on like i said you will be welcomed by this uh channel which is channel one the channel guide and it has six channels the interesting part about that is what's the game called black ops six Use your brain. Six channels for uh, for the six Black Ops. Now, if you go through the channels and you see all of these, all of these words right here have something to do with uh, with Call of Duty or Black Ops in some type of way, which is great. Now, um, let's flip through the channels real quick. We will start with channel one. Channel one was the the the, the news. I mean, the weather. Now, channel two is people putting up uh showing posters and putting up posters if you go to the next channel which is channel three that is the uh the mount rushmore bit that we uh that we seen at the uh on the what's the name and basically the trailer this is the trailer right here if you go to channel uh four which has not been uh displayed yet has not been previewed yet obviously in more time it will be there same thing with channel five channel six is a live news breaking news of basically showing monuments around the world and lies we trust and you know basically the world being attacked by the uh by the the uh the service so this is actually fucking dope because like i say all the time appearance is everything and look at the fucking appearance now let's go back to channel one Channel one shows you basically the channel guide and it has two highlighted channels, which we will read once they come back around. The channels is the is tear down the lies and the truth cometh. We don't exactly know what that shit means yet, but I'm sure that it's important if it's highlighted. Obviously, like I said, four and five has not been updated yet and it will be updated at a later time. Now, lastly. I will say that uh, I will say that if you want to, you can go to Twitter and you can go to the Call of Duty website and you can uh, give them basically post. I mean, a uh, comment or retweet with a quote your gamer tag and they will send you a calling card of Black Ops 6. You will get that and you will, you will be able to use that in the game. Um, lots of information in this video. Those are all of the uh, hidden gems that I have so far. Um obviously thanks to all of the leakers all of the uh, sources or whatnot and when we have more we will bring them right to you until next time peace